This ape says it's hard to watch, but this level of crime is unsustainable. The billions of AMC shares they have created in just the last few days is huge. This is going to blow up in their face. It feels like we are getting closer and closer to a pivotal point in this entire play. Whether it's good or whether it's bad, it feels like things are starting to heat up again. FTDs are put on the NYC threshold list when they have failed to deliver the stock for five consecutive days, which means they have failed to deliver AMC for 45 days. The rule is they must immediately close out the fails delivered by purchasing shares in the open market. A lot of us apes didn't even know about this rule before we got into this play, me included. As we know, they do not follow the rules though. Gary Gensler does not enforce them, it seems like. Open market means on the stock market, not swaps. So comment down below what you think is going on with the threshold security situation and why the shares don't seem to have been purchased. This ape says VWAGY, 64 million shares shorted. In 2008, GME 71.2 million shares shorted. And AMC 94.5 million shares shorted. Get the picture yet? If you don't see how big this is going to explode, then history never taught you a darn thing. Comment down below if you think the AMC squeeze is still ahead of us, or if you think it's nothing but something of the past. This ape says here is AMC's FTD data next to Apple's FTD data. On 714, for example, there were 10.9 million AMC FTDs and a total of five Apple FTDs. Yes, you heard me right, five versus almost 11 million. AMC has 519 million shares outstanding. Apple is 15.7 billion. Inexcusable, we need answers, and we would like them now. The ape says if you build it, they will come. Yes, talking about 4D movie experiences. AMC should make aggressive negotiations with studios, convert prior blockbuster movies to an experience that you cannot get at home. Think, touch, wind, smoke, motion, all things that would make a movie experience even better. All of course things that would make a movie experience even cooler. Studios will have two options, invest more in AMC and offer a much higher percentage of ticket prices. Or studios invest in making these changes with a tax write-off and for the opportunity to receive an ROI that, that would be unrivaled. Now I think that this is an amazing idea. With the way the world is moving with technology and virtual reality and everything else, this is a necessary step that the theaters are going to have to make at some point. They might as well start looking into it very soon. Make sure to check out all these other videos to catch up on all the latest AMC Stock DD and information you need.